Okay, here we go. I hope you have this remote. It should match this remote. What we're going to do is we're going to take off this top cover. There's this little cover that's holding the battery and the remote inside. It's the same uh, lever that you use to remove this uh, valet key. You know, the, the one that comes out. Anyways, push this back. Pull the lever, which has the little arrow on it, back and then insert your finger uh, fingernail down at the bottom and that should open up uh, this is what it looks like from the side so it just just opens up and you take that out you use a small screwdriver to just pull on this little plastic part what this does is it uh, takes out the the guts of the remote which is the real remote so we'll take that uh, clear plastic out which is the battery holder and when you pull it out you can just snap the battery out put the new one in make sure that the plus sign is on top and the plus sign is on this flat part where it has no buttons and you just push it back in flush and now we're gonna put it into the holder um, you know you can't push this thing in the wrong way but you can you can damage it I guess if you push it hard enough so just make sure that you're matching these buttons on top of the scuts with the buttons that are on top of the remote here so you don't make any mistakes it just slides in very easily and then you put this top cover back in and it snaps right in and then once it's in let's give it a test I'm gonna press the button and the red light comes on so as you see the red lights coming on um, I hope I didn't open the trunk of the car. <laughs> Anyways, um, this should help you. I mean, it helped me for a dollar. I just changed the battery on this thing. They wanted $25 to do that at the Lexus dealership.